Hello everybody and welcome to a beautiful fall day in my life. I don't have class on Tuesdays so I usually like to take the day to pick a place in Boston that I've never been to and just explore. I usually start by finding a park, thrift store, or bookstore that I want to try out and then just kind of continue on and see how the day goes. Today's pick ended up being Jamaica Plain so come with me on my little outing for the day. I really can't stress enough my love and appreciation for public transport in the city. It's so convenient and this bus was wonderful, it took me right to where I needed to go. My first stop was a Jamaica Plain Public Library to get some work done. I loved getting to walk around the picturesque little neighborhoods around Center Street, especially as the leaves are changing and it's fall. It was just very cozy and I honestly felt like I was on a Gilmore Girls set, which was very fun. So from the library, I headed to the Arnold Arboretum just to kind of get some fresh air, enjoy nature, and I was hoping to read my book under a tree. Definitely was able to fulfill that wish. I'm hoping my camera doesn't fall because you're balanced on the trees right now. But look how beautiful this place is. I've really come to appreciate any sort of park or nature that's in or around the city because sometimes I just feel like I need a break from all the people and the fast-paced lifestyle and all the concrete and so I love finding new places that I just feel comfortable and able to relax. Definitely Boston Common is a safe place for me that I visit frequently but I liked that I was able to explore a new area and I mean this park is massive and just acres and acres of trees and nature, some of it more manicured, others just almost like forests. It was just literally and figuratively a breath of fresh air that I really appreciated. And I mean, not a better place to read your book in Boston that I found at least. I then headed back to Center Street to do some thrifting. First up was Diversity Consignment, which had a pay by the pound section as well as some more curated vintage pieces that were a bit on the pricier side. I also went to a Boomerangs, which was my first time going to one of them. Pretty standard thrift store, had a decent selection and prices seemed fair. And then there was also a Goodwill all within a one block radius, which was pretty nice. And that was again, pretty standard Goodwill. I didn't get a look at the prices, but I'm assuming that they were pretty normal. Decent thrifting. I ended up not getting anything. I was more in a window shopping mood, but still very fun to go. After some delicious stir-fried tofu, I just kind of wandered around and ended up at Jamaica Pond, which again, just another beautiful little nature oasis. Big pond, the foliage is beautiful, it's got a little dock and boathouse kind of thing. Very pretty, very peaceful. Also, just Google the definition of oasis, and I'm not even sure if it applies, because I think it's supposed to be like water within a desert, so just think of it as a nature wonderland. pretty good, I can't lie. And it's also the sort of thing that like, I wouldn't be at all surprised to find a raisin in or a walnut. Oh, that's a raisin, so, you know. And I'm back in my apartment. It's 5.45 right now. I've literally just been lying in bed, watching Gilmore Girls and editing the video that I've like today, like this video. Um, but I have a club meeting that I need to go to, and then the Celtics game is on tonight. I'm back from my meeting, it was pretty uneventful, and now I'm watching YouTube and editing my video. 
Celtics play in 30 minutes. The Celtics won their first game, which was very exciting. I just spent the rest of the night relaxing, doing some journaling, and that's it. I really hope you guys enjoy this video. I really like how it turned out, and I hope you guys are just enjoying this sort of format and style of videos that I've been putting out. I've been enjoying it. I love you guys, and I will see you next time.